90% of the population of Catalonia will be under a curfew for another week. This is the news of the day, as is the LGBT plus rights demonstration in Barcelona that has attracted thousands of people. This is Catalan News in 100 seconds. A curfew affecting over 6 million of Catalonia's residents will be in place for another week. The judiciary has approved government plans to extend the 1 a.m. to 6 a.m. measure in 165 towns. The 12.30 a.m. closing time for all activities is expected to last all summer. Que caldrà continuar limitant la interacció social i prendre totes les mesures de prevenció que estiguin al nostre abast durant setmanes, durant tot l'estiu. A recent increase in reports of homophobic and transphobic violence has prompted an LGBT plus rights demonstration in Barcelona. Groups supporting these communities said that they had united for the first time in 44 years to organize the biggest LGBT plus protest to date. The price of electricity hit an all-time high yesterday at over 100 euros per megawatt an hour. And utility bills, experts say, will continue to be more expensive than usual until the end of the year. Malauradament, aquest preu, jo crec que d'aquí a final d'any ens hem d'acostumar. Contra més renovable cobreixi la demanda, més conseguirem baixar el preu. The Catalan Finance Institute paid the guarantee of the leaders accused of illicit foreign action. Spain's Court of Auditors is requesting they pay a 5.4 million euro fine for allegedly promoting independence abroad. Catalonia's summer festival season is still on despite COVID. The Northern Peradada Festival will see Rufus Wainwright play on Saturday. The Ballet Under the Stars with Maria Careva will also take place this weekend. That's it for today from Paseta Gracia in Barcelona, where the demonstration to reject violence against the LGBT community continues strong.